Hey guys, today's video is brought to you by AG1, a nutritional supplement brought to you by Athletic Greens. Listen, you know, we're out here on Rocky Mountain Race Week. We're racing all day, staying up till 4 a.m. editing videos. You need a little energy, this stuff does the trick. But it's not just energy, right here. 75 vitamins, minerals, and whole food to source ingredients made for just about everybody. So, you know, we're out here, we're eating at gas stations, we're getting crappy food, it dragged you down. AG1, has everything we need to keep us going. It gives us the energy, it gives us the proper nutrients for us to get through our day. This here's a travel pack. All you gotta do is rip it open, mix it into about eight ounces of water, stir it up and drink it. You throw them in your backpack, you can tell this one's been riding around in my backpack for a little bit. Toss them in before a trip. It couldn't be easier to take your AG1 every day. And like I always go back to my daily energy, that 2 p.m., you know, drag down when you're bogging down. This will give you the boost to get through that 60 foot. And today, guys, if you check out AG1 using my link, athleticgreens.com slash Cletus, you'll get a free one-year supply of vitamin D and five travel packs. Shout out to Athletic Greens for sponsoring today's video. I'm gonna go mix this up in a cup and drink it, and we're gonna get on the road. But that's it for now. Let's get to the live action. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me For On YouTube channel. Well, shoot we, boys. New day, new river. All right, guys, welcome to the big river day where we have a big jet boats with LS engines in them. And we are going in rapids like this. This one's got an LSA in it. We got to pop the engine hatch on that. Check it out. Our buddies, Ryan and Bo, brought their boats out so we can see what it's like to go on the big ones and we're scoping out the river right now you guys sure about this this looks pretty good, It'd be great, good. <laughs> oh my god the logs and the trees coming down are a little worried yeah little if you grab a log on the intake it you know kind of holds you up right oh yeah really Get to the impeller and just tear, you know, it makes it undrivable. And if you're getting to see logs coming down as they're coming through. Yeah. That is yeah, gnarly, we man. Go up we split right through the middle of that. Yeah. A lot of water flow, at least that'll help you keep off the rocks, right? Yep. A little bit. Yeah, you can see like the rock right here. Yeah. And there's one in the middle, we split right up through there and then up through the middle. <laughs> All right, we're ready. Hey, can we look in the engine compartment of your boat real quick? Yeah, yeah this is a 20 footer, right? Yeah, 21 actually. 21? Yep. Bean Marine? Love that. Wow. You got air ride seats and all that? Yeah. Look at the pump on this thing. Oh, dude. So sick. Hell yeah. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, man. <laughs> yep. Look at this, this is luxury. You got a heater in here? Oh yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. So what do you got turning on the left? Oh yeah, you stay dry. Dude, fire me up. It gets hot in there. That is insane. This boat is incredible, man. This is incredible. Really puts the minis to shame, but you know, they all have their own place. <laughs> I think you can sell the big one. Yeah. It, it, oh, yeah, you've got a twin engine, right? The big twin, yeah. That orange one. You love We're going to come back to ride the twins. Yeah. He's got one of these with twin LT4s in it. Just such a good looking boat, too, man. What does Ryan's have for an engine? He has an LSA also. Oh, really? Okay. Yep. So you, good to have the superchargers out here. Yeah, Give you that bottom end torque. Yeah. Well, thanks for having us out, man. This is going to be rad. Oh, it's going to be fun. Yes, it's sir. It's going to be hard to go back to uh, little three cylinders after riding an LS boats. Oh, I know these boats are going to be sick. I mean, going back to flat water that doesn't move is going to suck too. These I know. Boats. Look at that view though. God dang, it looks like art. Brother, you got the limo out here. How many seats are in that thing? Six these two big seats. That's cool. All right, we're riding with Bo today. Great, to rip it, brother. We got room for two. Yep. Yep. Us too, Zach. You're on the big dog. Yeah. We ride till dawn, brother. Right, get in there. I'm ready. What check out the interior? 1,200 horse. Right yeah. 1,200 horse. Y'all have them fully down or anything? Yeah. Oh, this is incredible. This is crazy. 
This puts the minis to shame, dude. Windshield wipers, we got heat and AC in this thing. <laughs> the stick steering is badass. <laughs> really quiet.
This time lapse has been interrupted by your boy Cleeter because we got new merch. We got Cleeter McFarland socks in the house. Guys, we're giving away a mini jet boat. Every $5 you spend on CleeterSmithFarland.com gets you an entry to win that jet boat and a Crown Vic to tow it. And the best part is we have brand new t-shirts to show you right now. Crack one off, Georgie, because we got the brand new Buenos Dias t-shirt. We got the new Ripsaw Let Freedom Rip t-shirt. Hell yeah, who doesn't want a tank on their t-shirt? We have Maddie's new t-shirt. This is what she tells me every time I go up to make a rip. She says, don't suck. And then I try to do my best, but sometimes I do suck and I crash my car. So it is what it is. Might have crashed my jet boat in tomorrow's video. We got Dr. Tunamal's new Stay Tuned t-shirt. That's pretty sick with the air fuel gauge. I like that. Jack stands up. Moon Tunes and big booms t-shirt the mini jack stand chilling and then we got my brand new hell yeah brother shirt check that out new cleater logo on the front hell yeah brother just a nice clean hell yeah brother american flag t-shirt we got the mcfarland marine my boat doesn't run on thank you floating <laughs> keychain just did that yeah New Maddie McFarland hat. Jack Stan Jimmy patch hats back in stock. Freedom Factory patch hats back in stock. And the new Cletus Turbo Hell Yeah Brother hat. All right, all right. You know the deal. CleasingFarland.com after the video. Every five bucks spent gets you a chance at that jet boat. Let's get back to the timeline. That sucker is boiling. Get a little supercharger back there, why not? That 
we made it to the top of the canyon. This rapid is undrivable. So now we got the hard part. We gotta go back down on plane. On plane. 40 miles an hour, baby. Jesus. No room for air. Holy crap. Oh, well no filter. <laughs> Dude, that was the most intense thing I've ever done. This is pretty much the most hardcore jet boating you can do. Oh, undoubtedly. In the country. I mean, I'm sure there's crazier places in the world. We but. jet boated down the mountain <laughs> in the water on the side of it. I mean, it was insane. Our boat literally went underwater. I saw you guys dip. Really stuffed her in there good. You got to rip one back.
you can trust it. Thanks, Ryan. Appreciate it so much, man. The boats are in one piece. One piece? No holes? I mean, that's ideal. No other experience of, of water sports than this. Like, this, yeah, is this is as extreme as it gets. I think. Yeah, this is the craziest thing I've ever done. Yeah, yeah. It's pretty good. So. All right, guys. Well, we had a hell of a day out here ripping these LS powered jet boats. Shout out to Bo and Ryan and Cody for uh, hauling us around all day up and down the river, which was incredible. Well, there's one more Idaho video coming. We're about to go shoot it. It's going to be pretty extreme. Dubo might not make it out, but that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Do it for Dale. We'll freaking see you later. Don't do burnouts at boat ramps, guys. But just know that you could.